what is up people what's up youtube welcome back to another video i know this one is way 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 over overdue i should have done a video man it's been crazy if i tell you the things that i go through on a daily basis you'll be like you know what take a break but um good news is i'm out we're heading out i'm heading to massachusetts right now to helping hands of america familiarize myself with the place once again it's been a very very long time since i've been there so <laughs> why not go back there and do what i love to do okay don't get it twisted this is what i love to do i love to be around cars but of course you got to put the work first you got to prioritize yourself yourself there's something in um, economics called scale of preference so i've arranged my stuff in an orderly way in an orderly fashion so um if the thing is shaking, it's because I have a, what's the name of it? A car full mount, that mount on the glass. So if the video comes out shaking, that's because of that. Um, I got another one again. I did try it, it's not working. Somebody please comment in the comment section and let me know which kind I should buy. But um, so I know some people might say, oh, you're being cheap, you're buying a cheap one. Yeah, of course, come on now. YouTube is not paying. I know I'm supposed to be the best in order to be the best. I have to be the best. But again, we'll have to start from, you know. So, um, yeah, so i see you guys when I get there. I'm out. This is a taco, man. Regular two doors. Headlight looks like they've been changed. Which is a plus for the potential buyer. $3,850. This one definitely comes with the four cylinder engine that I know. Um, this is the two wheel drive version. This is a stick shift. And no transmission. Let's pop that hood. Show you guys what's working on it's one. What year is this? This is a 20. Um, 2020... Please. What's going on? I need to see this thing. It's a 2006. So, it took me a while to find that. But it's a 2006, couple of rust. This is a nice um, work truck for somebody who who's starting um, like a mobile detail stuff or mobile mechanic stuff. This is a nice one for that person. Okay, you don't have to fix it up. Just use it like that. Yeah, this is the... This is Toyota's um, 2.7 liter four cylinder engine. Couple of oil leaks coming from the valve cover, which is just fine. Considering it's a Toyota, as they say. Yeah, but let's go ahead and look at another one. This is a Toyota Camry, probably a 2012 or 2013. These cars are ridiculously high, guys. $7,450 for a Camry. I don't even know the mileage on this thing. We're about to see it pretty soon. Let's walk around a little bit. Okay, now let's take you guys inside. I like the color, but it's so expensive. This car is not for, and it's locked. So somebody has probably engaged it or, let's go ahead and look at this infinity right here since we are close. This should be a QX or JX, one of them. Well, let's walk around. Buy it. No, nah, I'm just looking around. That's 5,800. Damn. I know. Checking it out now. Oh, okay, it's so a JX 35, 5,000, something, something. I don't like it. What's the mileage? One sixty-five. No problems? I don't know. I gotta check it out. Yeah, I see a, I see a warning light on the dash already. Yeah. Right there. Door open. Okay, maybe. <laughs> All right. I don't want this one anyway. I'm just looking around, boys. 
Anyway, let's look at this Range Rover right here. Okay. So I in my opinion, these these um they probably are not the strongest. They just for um protection. Okay, soft height at about maybe 10, 15, 20 ish miles per hour. That might protect the, the stuff. So, um, wiper link is definitely done. That's something to take note of. Is it open? Yes, it is. This one is closed. Um, this is the HSC. So, guys, bro, doing this thing in the summer is tough, doing it in the winter is tough every weather every season each season is tough okay so it smells it smells nice in here um damn these chairs Woo. heavy 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 um okay this side is locked um let me take you guys inside probably we can get oh, i'm a little bit familiar with it I love the the height, the um, the view you get from sitting in the driver's seat of a Range Rover. You know how the the hood, everything is just flushed in front of you. Um, when I was a teenager, my my uncle had one of them. Bro, it was the best experience ever riding a Range Rover. You know what I'm saying? So. Yeah, he had an older one to this one. Not even this one. I think it was the. I, I don't. I can't remember. But let's pop the hood and show you guys. Um, what is it? What's going on here? Um, this is a. Hold up. Okay, I'm not. It's not showing the date. But come in the comment section if you know the date of this one. Probably a 2010 or 2009. Something, something. Now with these, it's difficult to open, to pop your hood. Like, literally, it's very difficult to do that. And it's right under here. It's right there. So, <laughs> good luck in trying to do that each and every day. Um, two, four six eight so that's a v it's a v8 that's a v8 right there it's not supercharged or anything we have brand new battery made in germany um 25 of 22 i don't know what that is it does say 11 of 22 over there too it says 11, 22, and it says 25 or 22. I don't know what's going on, but this is how it looks. Engine looks a little on the dry side. I'm just not a Range Rover fan, so we'll pass this one. Let me check this one right here. This is a GMC Acadia. $6,250 for a car that looks like this. Bro, these people will have a flat tire right here. Is it open? Yeah, it is. Does it say the, does it say the matter? No. Probably dead. Dead, dead, dead. Dead, dead, dead. This one comes with a captain style seat. Um is it me or these um headrests are turned opposite? Or is is it um electric that goes in front and backwards? This one is pretty much rough. I'm not gonna spend my time on this one. Let's look for something good. And this one is sold, but I just want to do a quick walk around. Matter of fact, I'm just going to do a quick walk around the cheap aisles. Um, this is an MDX. Um, I don't know what the problem is on this one, but it's sold. It's locked and sold. So let's just walk around. I'm just going to do a quick um, walk. This aisle is just a Legos of Outback. Bro, what's going on with me? see what happens if you don't um if you stop doing something for a while you tend to forget so this is uh outback this is sold too this is an xterra 
and it's sold. Um, I've never been a fan of the exteriors. I don't know why. This one is a, um, a CX-9 or a 5? No, this is a CX-5. This is the shorter one. This is the smaller one. No. Oh, CX-7. Okay. So that's a 9, that's a 7, that's a 5. Bro, Maz Mazda is crazy. This one is still here. I don't know what's the problem. I see a, I see a belt hanging out. So, oh boy, it smells so good in here. It have the, it comes with the aftermarket stuff. It's a bulk. It comes with heated seats as well. Let's pop the hood and see what's going on. Why is that belt out? Um, definitely something I might do in the nearest future come and get a car here as a project car and just see if I can, you know, get it back to life. You know what I'm saying? Like something like this with the oil in in oil in the coolant. Oh, this one is the uh -huh, this one comes with the turbo. Okay. We don't have belts. So I see your intercooler out here and these guys made it very easy. They showed you the way the belt goes back on. So that's nice. A very good and huge shout out to the mechanic that did that. This one is so $1,650. This would have been a very good project car. Um, oil in coolant, possible selling the head gasket is gone. Okay. And it's an all wheel drive too, so that's nice. Um, no keys. This one is so $650. This one is $850. Same issue, probably overheating. And it's locked. All right, this is a PT Cruiser. Needs Altenita and it runs. $950. This one, transmission problem is sold. This one has a transfer case problem. It's not sold, but it's beat up. This one is sold. Don't know what the problem is, but it's sold. Um, this is a cord, rotted rear cross member, $650. Engine might still be good. This is a 2000 and probably seven, eight or nine Camry. It doesn't say what the problem is. This one can be fixed. Pour very hot water on this thing and pop it up from the back. It works the magic. Take me litter. Grab a um, Toyota emblem right there. Put it there. Um, change this fender. <sighs> change the fender in the door. And you're good. Um, let's see. Uh, this looks good. This 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 is that's nice. That's that. Um, this one says frame rot, nine hundred and fifty dollars. Transmission problems, nine hundred and fifty dollars. This one is. This one has all the bells and whistles. What are all of these? You have. Um, auxiliary stuff music i don't know what that is it has a remote remote control well probably some of these aftermarket lights and stuff this one is do not drive it's a volvo this one is a kind um it's a porsche we saw this one it still sits at two thousand nine hundred and fifty dollars it's not gonna go nowhere with that price this one is a MKZ or M is there an MKZ? Let me check in the back. Do not run. All right. This is a very big car, guys. It's big. Um, it's an MKS, not a Z. Sorry, my bad. This is it. I don't like Lincolns. Anyways, this one is $3,650 and that one is sold. So let's go ahead and since we've occupied the the lot let's go ahead and 
look at something else thanks so much for watching the video guys i'm so excited right now because it's been a while since i actually came out i don't know the last time i have to check my i have to check my youtube um, portal to see when was the last time i ever did a video i know some of you like oh he's he's one of those youtubers who just come get pe make people get used to his channels and then he just ghost on them yeah i'm sorry i did ghost i did i did um i ghosted on you guys but i'm back again um i'm here for good I know somebody say, yeah, right, you just said it, you just saying it, but I'm here for good. Anyway, um, I'm always here. It's just, it's just that sometimes I will take time off to um, focus on other things that are more um, of importance to me at the time. So, but it is what it is. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like the video if you did. Subscribe to the channel if you're not a subscriber. And um, that's what I do. That's what we do on here. Look around, check cars out. See you guys again out in the next one. I'm out.